Hello YouTube, this is uh, Dietrichstein with another tutorial. In, th in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use make a plane using a Crazy Man 32's plane system. Kit system, whatever. So first, what you're going to do is you're going to go search models, and then you're going to search plane get old. And then this should come up, and you click that, not the black one. And then you sh that should appear. And then you plus that, plus that, plus, and then you plus main parts, and then you delete the sample in your landing gear. And then you go to other parts, and you delete everything in other parts. And then it should look like this. And then you drag that into your cockpit section of your plane. Not the circle, just the platform with the seat on it. And so I'm not going to really put it anywhere fancy, I'm just going to put it some randomly somewhere in this plane and then it should look like that and then what you're going to do is you're going to find all the landing gear in your plane and what, how do you do that is you go to your landing gears and there should be pictures on your wheels this is usually on the more recent planes in Roblox but it, it if you don't have well yeah so there should be pictures on your wheels aka decals so when you double click on your wheel, this should be highlighted, and then you go to the part that that is that that's that picture is on, and then you rename it wheel part or whatever you want, and then you do that with all the wheels. I'm just pretending I'm doing that with all the wheels. Double click, you double click on the wheel, you, and then you click on the part that the picture is on, you rename it wheel part or whatever. And then when you're all done with renaming every single wheel on your plane wheel part or whatever, you're going to click on your plane, then you're gonna click on that, and then you're gonna have to and then you find all the wheel parts inside of the plane that you just renamed. In my case they're all right here. Let me just make sure there's no others Nope. And then you're going to cut all the wheels. And then it should look like this when you've cut them all. And then you're going to click on your plane kit. And then you're going to paste them in landing gear. And then they should all come back like this. And if the landing gear, like, appears on the top of the plane or somewhere where it's not supposed to be, lift the plane in the air and try it again because there might be some bricks under it interfering with that so when you're done with that you click on your plane again and then you cut all the parts inside of your plane and then everything should be cut except for that stuff and then you click on your plane kit again and then you paste that in other parts and once again, if this all goes in weird places, just lift it up in the air because there might be a brick interfering with it. And then you have your working plane. It's actually pretty easy to do that. So now I'm going to show you what the finished product look, looks like. So one second. Um, And then when you have it like you want it, so I just colored it all black and stuff, uh, you can test it, and it should work. So, one second, I'm going to test. And I'm sorry if this is a little bit quick, but it is pretty easy to do, so uh, yeah. So basic overview of the steps, you paste, you get your plane, you find the plane kit old model, you delete everything in landing gear, you delete everything in other parts, you put that plane kit in your cockpit section, and then you find all the wheels in the plane you want, you want to use, you rename them all wheel part or whatever, you put all the landing gear in the landing gear section in the plane kit and then you 
go back to your plane, you cut everything in the plane, and you paste it in other parts in the plane kit. So yeah, right now I'm going to test it. So, flying over there. Once again, this is just my alternative account, so that's why I don't look all cool. Because I build out my plans on my alternative account, because my uh, main account, it has all these... It has way, he has way too many models. This is just my old one. So, yeah. It should work. If it doesn't work, it's just a glitch that I don't not know how to fix. So, uh, let's try to find it. Yeah, sorry for the lag. There's, there's a lot of planes in my, in my, uh, thing, so... And as you can see, it is moving, and if this were a less laggy place, it would take off and fly much, much faster than this. And landing gears work. And, uh, yeah. So, thanks for watching my video. Subscribe, comment, and rate. As always, oh, and one, be before I say as always, goodbye, I'm... There's going to be another video after this talking about how you put and cu you customize your plane by putting li liveries on it. I don't know if I pronounced that, but right. But like you can put the British Airways logo and stuff to make it look like a real plane. So, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Comment. Oh, pff, I already said that, so goodbye.